This is going to be an uncomfortable conversation. I, I don't know this year, probably not, but maybe next year. Somebody in the top three is going to have to be taken out. And, and I say that as here in Philadelphia, but when this dude is healthy and he's at his top of the game, there are few people in the NBA that are better than Anthony Davis. And a lot of you forgot. A lot of you slept. Like you slept on this video. Oh, I just watch it because it's fun. It, uh, oh, we had a couple of profitable nights. We go two and three last night. Not so good. That's fine. But we go right back to it. And yeah, we're going to talk about Anthony Davis, who might be the league MVP when healthy. Five bets in five minutes. If you're new, you hit the thumbs up button. You subscribe. I hit the clock. And then we go five bets in five minutes. It's really that simple. It's that easy. The clock is already starting. So let's start with James Harden. Sixers laying 10 and a half. Come off a big win against the Cleveland Cavaliers in which I thought Joel Embiid fouled out, but then I guess he did not foul out, which was fantastic for the Sixers because that's how they win the game. But on the road against Charlotte, on the road, against, that's a stupid commercial. Boot them all in, out of here. Sixers right now, healthy road favorites. James Harden's going to need 20 assists to get here. Tyrese Maxey scoring a little bit more. Joel Embiid is on an absolute scoring tear to score every single basket every single night. So James Harden getting to 41 PRA. I don't think the rebounds are going to be there tonight. Lengthier elements that you'll have to deal with with Charlotte. So seven, six, seven rebounds is not going to push James Harden's, uh, what, 11 assists over the top to get to 41 PRA. Very comfortable staying below that as I am comfortable in laying the six at home for Cleveland. I don't think Cleveland gets swept by the Washington Wizards tonight. I don't think that's the case. I also think, and you know better here, that loss to the Sixers was marred by that call that was overturned, mind you, and good job by Doc Rivers. You don't hear me saying that much. But the Cavs have been playing better. The Cavs at home are a tough out, a tough team to face. Washington is super tight. There's another team that's super tight that we're going to get to here, and, and I want to play against that. But Washington neck and neck right here with Chicago trying to advance and be comfortable into this play-in scenario. Too tight of a situation here. No, oh, man, we beat these guys. We can beat these guys. You're not good enough. We talked about Washington in another element here where they're just not good enough to ride long wing streaks. They're not good enough to sweep a team like Cleveland with the final game being on the road. I like the Cavs to bounce back from that loss to the Sixers. Here, I'm just going to take the, the Golden State Warriors to win this. As soon as... DraftKings complies and allows me to put that bet in. That's what my bet would be. The Golden State Warriors plus 135. And the reason why I'm looking at this is twofold. First, you have Steph back. Love that. And we saw even in the loss, there is everything possible, at least by him. Things are being done in that capacity to keep your team in it. The Warriors have sucked all year on the road. That hasn't changed. We've made fun of them for sucking on the road. Nothing has changed all overnight. They just lost again on the road. Like it's it's just terrible. It's a bad product. But what's worse is the Atlanta Hawks effort on defense. Especially over the last couple of games in change, it has been non-existent. That should favor the Golden State Warriors in this. That should allow Golden State to come out and get a rare road win. So I don't need the three points. You can take them. You want to go the coward's route, take the three points. I'm fine with a plus 135. That's where we roll now. All right, Spurs plus eight and a half. Hey, San Antonio, last time we talked about them, did just enough to get to overtime, and unfortunately, they lose to Dallas because at that point, it's out of your hands. They had enough to win that game. We had them outright. It was one of our losses. I understand that. But Memphis is not the same team without John Morant and Steven Adams or Steven Adams and John Morant because they were struggling even with Morant and no Steven Adams. So I think this is the bigger part where we can get a jump on the Spurs taking advantage of a team in Memphis that is in total disarray. 
And eight and a half, as we've seen, eight and a half, huge. We're getting this. I imagine this closes maybe eight, seven and a half if we're lucky. So I'm going to get in now at eight and a half for a Spurs team that should stick around. Absolutely should stick around. Last play. It's a plus money play on the way out. It's not a gigantic one, but it's just one that makes sense to me. I don't see any reason why Anthony Davis should pass the ball for the rest of the season or at least until LeBron is fully healthy. There is just no reason for Anthony Davis to be involved in any assist. In fact, all the assists should come as a result of Anthony Davis scoring baskets. Rebounds and points. Points and rebounds. You want to get a dime or two in there? That's fine. But he's not going to get to three assists tonight. And I will gladly take the under two and a half at plus 110 and suggest that you do the same. Fire it up. Five and five in the NBA. Easy stuff. Easy game. We'll go five and oh tonight. That's all. That'll be a massive parlay, won't it? I'll show you what that parlay looks like, just in case you're curious. I, I know I know you're out there. I know you're curious. I know you want to see. Take 90 seconds out of your life. Click this link below. New Jersey, Ohio, Virginia, Colorado. You're in these states. Why haven't you taken advantage of Bet365? Take 90 seconds out of your life. Sign up below. You have to be 21 or older. Gambling problem? Call 1-800-GAMBLER. Live in a state where you can legally place a wager. All easy stuff. Bet a dollar. Get $365 back in bonus bets. That's it. It's easy. $1 into $365. All right? And then you can come hang with us on the Insider to Access, the Discord. Well, what are you doing for me lately on the Discord? Last night, last night. I'll give you that. You want to see what we did? I mean, look, it's I'm not here to brag. I'm here to remind you that we're hitting. I'm here to remind you that I'm not the only person in my channel that's hitting. We've got multiple people out there that continue to hit and smash and share plays. It's a community. Yeah, you'll get winning picks, but it's a community. That's what you're here for. And that's why we want to give you half off below. Sign up. Use my code ESINSIDER. The link is below. It's a beautiful thing to be fun, a part of a fun community. That's what we want you to do. Live today, 4 o'clock, Monday through Friday, Eastern. We'll see you.